Hello, my most amazing artists. Today, we are going to be doing another peace sign project, but it's something that reminds me of peace signs. It might remind you of peace signs too. We're gonna be doing a couple of Volkswagen bus and bug drawings. Let's check it out. You can use a pencil or a pen or a marker or a sharpie if you have one. So here we go. The first thing that we're going to draw is the side of our bus. And down this way, so two lines side by side. And you can see that they're kind of curving together. What we're going to eventually make is the bottom of a square. So it kind of looks like that, but it looks like, to me, it kind of looks like a piece of toast. It doesn't have pointy edges. It's got kind of round edges. So that's going to be the bottom of our van. And then up here, we're going to draw kind of a curved rainbow shape line. So I'm going to connect both of these with a curved line. So it looks like that it looks even more like a piece of bread. Now we're going to draw this bottom part and it kind of sticks off right down here. And it's a long skinny rectangle with curved edges. Okay, while we're down here we can go ahead and draw our tires. One there and one here. All right, next we're gonna draw our windshield. So what you can do is we're just gonna draw a line that goes right beside the top of our van, just like that. So kind of following that same rainbow shape and then connecting it in a straight line at the bottom. So there's our windshield. Okay, and down here in the middle of the bottom of our square, so right here, kind of in the middle, we're gonna start and do half of a rainbow shape going that way and then the other half is going to go this way. I'm going to start up here. So that way. Okay. Almost done. I'm going to draw two little mirrors sticking off the side. Kind of looks like a... almost looks like an ear. <laughs> but it's like an oval shape. I'm going to do one on this side too. So there's my mirrors. Okay, and then we have two headlights. One here, just a circle. And one here, another circle. Beautiful. And then right in the middle of our bus, we have our symbol, our Volkswagen symbol. But today we are actually going to do a peace sign in the middle. If you would like to give your bus some windshield wipers, <laughs> and if you would like to do a mirror that hangs down here, you can do that as well. <laughs> pencils is to press lightly and how I make myself press lightly is by holding the pencil way far back here and coloring in one direction really lightly and it looks like I'm going really fast and scribbling but as you can see I am just evenly laying that pencil down where I want it to be in one direction so I'm going up and down, I'm not going side to side, up and down, left to right, back and forth. I'm going one direction, just up and down. Let's 
So my friends, if you would rather draw the Volkswagen bug, or if you would like to do both of them, here um, is a really quick video on how I drew the bug. Has a lot of the same shapes, same kind of curvy lines. We don't have any pointy edges. They're all pretty curved. So I know this video is really fast, but you can always pause these parts as you're drawing. So one thing you've probably learned from being in my art class is that when we color our picture with markers, we do not scribble like this. We use the fat side, not the skinny side, and we lay it down in thick, broad lines, just like this, and it helps to not look so scritchy. You can use the skinny or the fine point to fill in any of those little gaps. So this is why we like to use the broad side of the marker in color and lines. It just helps your drawing not to look so scritchy or scratchy. Well, as you can see in this video, I was trying my best to use the big fat side of the marker to fill in those spaces and color in lines and not so scribbly scrabbly. And there you have it, my friends. I hope you enjoy. Stay groovy.